Love it or hate it, cottage cheese is the most versatile cheese on the planet, and I'm here to show you why. Not only is it perfect for anybody embarking on their fitness and health journey because it's packed with whey protein, it can also be used in so many more ways than you would ever expect. I posted a video last November about cottage cheese with Doritos. That combination itself was not bad. I gotta say that's not bad at all. But some of the comments I got on that video really got me thinking. Have you ever had cottage cheese, strawberry flavored, banana milk smoothie? Uh, nope. Can't say I have. I couldn't find any flavored cottage cheese, so here's what we're gonna do. Half a cup is 125 grams, so we'll do 250 grams. 250 grams of cottage cheese. Two tablespoons of honey. I'll do about 120 grams of frozen strawberries, half a banana, about half a teaspoon of vanilla extract, and to top it all off, one cup of milk. It's no plug. I don't know if you've ever been to the Rainforest Cafe, but they let you keep the cup. All right, cottage cheese milkshake. That's really smooth. Definitely has the consistency of a milkshake. That's delicious. I got quite a few comments asking me to dip chips into cottage cheese from Takis to Hot Cheetos to spicy Doritos. Instead of doing that, I'm gonna create a cottage cheese queso and try it with some tortilla chips. I'm gonna use the blender again. I'll start with half a cup of cottage cheese. Quarter cup of triple cheddar, two cloves of garlic, tablespoon of salsa, a few dashes of cayenne pepper for an extra kick, pepper, and some salt. Well, we've run into a problem. It's not really blending because there's not enough shit in there. We're gonna transfer it over to a microwavable safe bowl and see what happens. It's looking a little interesting, so I'm gonna give it a stir and throw it back in there for another, say, 20 more seconds. That smells delightful. I'm excited for this. Wow. That is really good. And to think that I'm dipping my chips into something that's like relatively healthy, high protein at least. I wonder how well this keeps. I do want to make burrito bowls tonight and I think this would be a great addition. Speaking of which, anybody else have these bowl condoms? Not easy to use, but pretty convenient. We all know cottage cheese can be easily incorporated into your breakfast. You could add it to your scrambled eggs. I just tried that last week, it was delicious. You can add some berries and some honey to it. I always used to eat that. Did you know you could create pancakes out of cottage cheese? Pedro said to put cottage cheese with pancakes. I'm gonna put the cottage cheese inside the pancakes. Using the blender again, we're gonna put three quarters of a cup of cottage cheese. One cup of oats, two eggs. You could probably put some like white sugar in there. I'm gonna just put some maple syrup, about two tablespoons. One teaspoon of cinnamon, two teaspoons of baking powder, splash of vanilla extract, couple dashes of salt. I'm gonna pre-mix this a little bit. Curious to see how this turns out. There's no milk or water in here. Is this really all it needs? We'll blend that up. All right, I think that's as good as it's gonna get. Yeah. It's bubbling. Why is it bubbling? There is steam coming off this. Either way, that batter looks pretty good. I don't know why I made booby pancakes over here. Perfect. I'll take a bite without any syrup first, but who eats pancakes without syrup? Psychopaths, that's who. Texture's good. 
The smell is a bit better than the flavor, but the flavor is good. The fact that these are high protein pancakes makes me very happy. I'm gonna try it with some syrup. Oh, that's good. Oh, that is good. The pancakes have to be my favorite. If you're scared of cottage cheese because of what it looks like or the texture, either close your eyes or use a blender because it's worth it. I'm going to keep going on my journey to find unlikely food combinations that just work like this pancake. You want to follow along on the journey, make sure you subscribe. We'll talk to you soon.